Eagle Mountain residents are growing concerned about their tap water after some have reported feeling sick and developing skin problems. Fox 13 News reporter Darian DeBrule spoke with both residents and the city. Bonnie and Brett Bartleson are two of many Eagle Mountain residents concerned about the city's tap water. People getting sick, um, pets dying, uh, mainly fish, um, the water tasting weird, salty, thick, oily. So Brett began doing his own tests. Tested it with a silver nitrate solution and it precipitates silver chloride and um, it immediately precipitated and that's uh, pretty much just shows that there's a lot of chlorine in the water. Bonnie says her daughter had an adverse reaction to her bath water and her son got sick. I just started hearing her crying and so I asked him what was going on and she said that her skin hurt and that she, her body was itchy. And my yeah. biggest concern is that it's making people sick, it's making kids sick. There's something wrong, something needs to be done. Our testing is showing that the water is safe, there's nothing wrong with it and uh, as a result of that, uh, that any uh, thoughts or perceptions that our water quality may be connected to that um, are, are, are misguided. Tyler Moffat is the Eagle Mountain City Communications Manager. He says the change in water characteristics can be attributed to the city switching its water well source. That has induced, I guess, a change in, in flavor profile and odor profile. The U.S. Environmental Protection Agency says total dissolved solids in water should be at or below 500 milligrams per liter. Moffitt says Eagle Mountain's water well source tested in the mid 800s. But Moffitt says 800 is a number to think about, not be concerned about. There are many sources that recommend many different things. What Eagle Mountain City does is follow the state of Utah's guidelines, which uh, basically says anything below 2,000 is, is acceptable and, and safe to drink. But the Bartlesons aren't convinced. We've been living out here for about three years, and it's always been around 300. It would be nice to be on the average side of things. If residents do have any concerns about their water, they are encouraged to reach out to the city or to the city's water department. In Eagle Mountain, I'm Darian DeBrule, Fox 13 News, Utah.